this video we want to show you how to use the Land Manager in the Operations Center. This tool enables you to manage guidance lines and boundaries. Within this tool you can view, create and edit guidance lines as well as view boundary lines. Go to the Tools icon, open the Land Manager Hub. Find fields by using the search bar or filter menu. The search bar allows you to search by field, client and farm. Additionally, you have a filter function to filter by client, farm and or year. In our example, you see the list of all fields from the filtered client. The field list allows you to show and hide guidance tracks and boundaries on the map. By clicking on the eye icon, the drop-down list is expanded and all boundaries and guidance lines are shown for that field on the map. Multiple fields can be shown on the map at one time. Individual items in the list can be hidden by clicking on the eye icon again or the entire list can be hidden by clicking on the eye icon of the field name. Next to each line item, boundary and guidance track is a checkbox that allows to easily delete or export to CSV the item selected. To get more information on that guidance line, click on the name of the guidance track in the list. A pop-up window will open. Here you can edit the track. You are able to edit the AB points, heading, track spacing, snap to boundary or length. Click Done if changes have been made. Finally, you can edit the name and save it. To create a new straight track guidance lines, click on the Create New Plus button. Select Field from the drop-down list. Enter the implement track spacing. Create an A point by clicking on the map or entering a latitude longitude point in the menu. Click on the map to create a B point or enter in a heading in order to create the AB line. The heading can be adjusted as well as the latitude longitude values. The line can also be adjusted by clicking on the AB points and moving them with the mouse or by checking the Snap to Boundary box. Click Done. Name the guidance track and click on Save. All changes are now saved and the new created line is added in the fields list.